Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Let's Go Eevee and Pikachu! Now I know you guys have been waiting five days for some hot Koga action that didn't come out right, but we've got a few things to get through first. <laughs> Remember a few episodes ago when Aaron evolved a whole bunch of Pokemon, like four or five of them? Well, now it's my turn, so in between episodes, and sessions for that matter, I went and caught me a few Eevees, just enough to evolve. And I thought I'd catch a couple for Aaron as well, but he already got his own. I got lucky. And because I already caught six, had a chain going, I figured, you know what? Why not get a few more? And then a few more. And then a few more. And then a few more. I swear I'm not addicted to it. I wasn't trying to catch an Eevee or a uh, Shiny or anything. But, <laughs> you know, it's just how it goes, man. Don't feel bad. I've got a giant stack. Anyway, it's time to get some evolutions out of the way. First off. Power up pocket. Water stone. Go. Eevee, go. What? Eevee is evolving. Oh, I guess Aaron's gonna go ahead and do his as well. I'm doing the exact same ones you are, just to keep in line. The ones that Aaron uh, evolved a few episodes ago, I'm gonna do that during his fight, so you don't have to see it twice. And Aaron's evolving his Eevees right now. Yeah, but we're gonna. Now show you might you. be thinking. Why is this guy playing Pokemon Let's Go Eevee evolving the Eevees? Because he already got an episode started with evolutions. Dang it, now it's my turn. Its cell structure is similar to water molecules. It melts into the water and becomes invisible. Yes, it I can. I don't think that's accurate. It can literally be water. Ooh, water gun. It's better you know, than nothing. Vaporeon doesn't look too bad. Except for its Bye, giant man. tail. I mean, look at its giant tail compared to the rest of its body. That tail should really be smaller. I believe next in the line was Jolteon, right? Pretty it sure could it's be. Jolteon. I'm going with Jolteon. Well, even if they're not in line, they'll be in line in the Pokedex. Alright, here goes another. It's too bad you can't use an Ice Stone. Did you already do yours, Aaron? Glaceon. You don't have a Thunderstone, do you? Nope. <laughs> I'll get that later. Up. I checked and I guess I counted a thunderstorm. Arguably the best one. Mm, ah, yeah. hail! I don't have another thunderstone. I was supposed to use that on Pikachu. Ah. I, mm. I gotta run and bite one while you're fighting. I guess I'll do that while you're fighting him later. A sensitive Pokemon that easily becomes sad or angry. Every time its mood changes, it charges power. It must oh. be really indecisive then because it's really strong. Let me guess, thunder. Ha! Ah. What's the last one gonna learn? Flamethrower? Well, it's certainly not going to learn Zippy Zap. By helping hand, again. What is it going to learn? I hope it doesn't try to learn Flare Blitz. Fire Blast. <laughs> Could learn Fire Fang. Well, it's got to be the low-level version of a Fire Attack. So Ember? It can't be Ember. That's too low-level. It could be Flamethrower. Alright, here's the last one. Eevee. If it does Go. learn Flare Blitz, that's going to be ridiculous. There goes Aaron. Ahead of you, actually. Now, Flareon, in my opinion, now. looks the best out of the three. Which I like Jolteon. Flareon. Surprising nobody. I feel like Vaporeon. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. And your downside. ass is on fire. The only downside is that Flareon isn't really all that useful. Flareon's data will be added to the Pokedex. It has a flame chamber inside its body. It inhales, then breathes out fire that is over 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit. So basically, I call hacks. So basically, it's uh, smoke yeah. Ember. Wow. Okay. Well, I'm not well, Ember's about the same strength as Water Gun. Yeah, I know. And Thunder Shock. Ta-da! Now, if they learned Thunderbolt, uh, shoot, Surf and uh, Flame. Now, Ball, I know I told useful. you guys that I was going to evolve those ones Aaron did off camera, but. Gloom is kind of a permanent party member, so let's go. Oh, also, during the whole capture EVs trying to get in a uh, shiny quest, never happened actually. Uh, I decided, you know what? I'm leveling up Gloom. Didn't even think about it. Let's go ahead and put him on 45 to get him that Moonblast move I needed. So now I can evolve him. That's a her reminder. Is mine a female? Yes. I didn't pay attention. Vile plume. Vileplume's data will be added to the Pokedex. Also, Vileplume is broad huge. Large. Whatever. Flapping sound very loud. It's the Rafflesia of Doom. Okay. 
Now, I have come up with a name to give it as well. I figured this out the other day. Oddish was actually the first Pokemon after Pikachu that I caught. Which is why it's been in my party for so long. Mm -hmm. So, I've got the perfect name for it. Derp Spavoner! This is my number two, man. <laughs> number two. <laughs> uh, okay, now, you've probably been wondering this whole time why there's Pikachu at my party and why I'm wearing the Pikachu stuff. Well, one of the first episodes, I, th I thought, you know what? Let's have Pikachu on my shoulder and a Pikachu following me. And I'm also a Pikachu, kind of. Except uh, this Pikachu is female. Alright, I need to go buy me a Thunderstone. So we're switching back to Aaron. Hey, hi. I'm in my box at the moment because I want to point out my luck is bullshit. You remember this shiny Doduo I caught? Let me guess. You got another one? Really? Let me guess. It happened while you were looking for the shiny pony top. Yes. Look at all these Ponyta I caught. But if you were looking for a Ponyta, why didn't you just let the Doduo go? It was shiny. Dude, you've already got a shiny. It was shiny. But you're looking for a specific shiny, dude. You can give me a shiny Doduo. I'll trade it to you later. You broke your combo. It was fine. I was about done, and that kept me from going too far over. You got another shiny, and I haven't seen a single freaking one. And hey. I farmed forever to find one. Hey. Remember, I got a shiny Caterpie on a catch combo one. I hate you. Yeah, but you got a shiny, though. I never caught a shiny. I never had a shiny show up in my file. Yeah, but I gave you one. That doesn't count. All right, are you ready, Robert? Yes, you... let's go, Koga! He disappeared. What? <laughs> Shadow clone jutsu. A mere child like you dares to challenge me? The very dear makes me shiver with mirth. Very well, I shall show you true terror as a ninja master. Crap, what floor are they on? Opponents can't lay a hand on me, as poison brings their steady doom. Despair as you feel the creepling horror of poison-type Pokemon. Crippling horror? <laughs> Creeping, You crippling. could say he has a toxic love. <laughs> you are challenged by gym leader Koga. Alright, you will one day be in the Elite Four. It's time oh, to spoilers. Ugh, dog. It's time to crack this Koga nut wide open. Let's go, Smolax. Who is now level 40. Smolax. Just gonna headbutt it. Oh, He's gonna protect spam. Say hello to my problem with Koga. He loves to use protect. And the more he uses it, the more I get to hit him. Eventually. Unless he does that. Robert, I have no problem with this. Oh, do you have facade? Yes! Found it. You gotta be careful, though. This is gonna limit how many turns you can be out. Yeah. Luckily, I believe the count resets when you switch out. Oh, this... Aww. He can't use it twice in a row without risking it failing, though. Yeah, but he might have it work, which means... You know, problem. Do one more time before I need to heal. What? He's just gonna explode. What a perfectly good waste of Pokemon. Ouch. You're not gonna take down Smolax's girth? Uh, he might. I should have rested instead. Actually, yeah, you're probably gonna die from Toxic. Oh, you survived. It's time to uh, switch. All right, I'm All right. back in Fuchsia. This is probably not the right switch eh. in. I've got a Vulpix, Pikachu, Jigglypuff, and Nidorino to evolve. All right. Or no, Nidorino. No. Yeah. Whichever one the male one is. Eno. Yeah. Okay, dig. A tunnel. He's gonna protect on the first turn. Yep, I knew it. Now watch him try to Toxic or something else on the second turn. Why would he try to Toxic a Poison type? No, oh, that's true. He'll try something else, though. We're fat. It's a speed eye. Oh, it wasn't enough. 
Moon Blast? But I'm resistant! Dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel. He didn't even try to protect again. Oh god, he's gonna protect next turn. I'm not sure if I'll get these evolutions. <laughs> he tried another Moon Blast. Blast. He didn't try to protect, why? Get dug, son. You know, the Muck is actually the most dangerous member of his team because it can minimize. Mm -hmm. And if he minimizes, you might never hit him. On the upside, though, it looked like he never got the chance, so... Oops. I need more stones than this. Crap. It happens. I needed a Fire Stone, too. Oh, no, not Psychic. This is Look, gonna hurt. Luckily, it's not a stab move. Ow. That stung a little bit. It's bug poison, not bug flying. Uh, ow! Robert, you tanked it. Be happy. Alright, now what's Venomoth gonna do? It is gonna do psychic, but, you know, miss. Aw, oh, man. Bug must be resistant to ground. Oh. Uh, well, you're probably gonna die. Is there anyone you can switch in that would be strong? Also, why do you have Cubo? It's ready to evolve. That's got to get it to hit a level. Oh, so you just get cheat and use items? Hey, I used one item. You know, that's that's one really bad thing about not being able to have hold items anymore, other than I can't get Light Bulb to get you. No Everstone. Mm, yeah. True enough. You better hope this doesn't crit or else you're going down. And now hit it! I <laughs> just punch him with everything. Wow, Nido King wants to learn a move. I replaced Helping Hand again. <laughs> ha! Also, one of the department uh, store dudes was asking me about Helping Hand. Huh. Uh, you're gonna need uh, good Pokemon for this. Well, you haven't used him yet. Or is it her? Her. Yeah, that's right, it's her. Uh, have Switch you it in. Eevee time. Do you think you got enough bow ties? No, Robert. What's up? Have you actually tried to evolve your starter Eevee? Yes, it says you can't. Oh, okay. Because I said compatible on my Pikachu a second ago when That's I was evolving this one. Yeah, but if you try to use it on it, it won't let you. Oh, okay. Glitzy Glow! Overpower! And you get a light screen. Ooh, Thunder Punch. Oh. Was, that was so adorable. Such a good toxic, Robert. Yep, this will definitely help him. His muck was the only really dangerous thing. Especially in Fire Red and Leaf Green. Because it really did love to spam minimize. You son of a... Turd. Hey, Aaron, you remember minimize, don't you, in our playthrough? Yes! That muck... Was that on this channel? I can't remember. Yes. That was my second project on the channel. All right. Buzz Buzz. Dead. Hey, that Koga, you rampant fish nugget. You beat Jim Litter Koga. Jim Litter. <laughs> you have proven your worth. You get money. What else is he going to say? Take that money. Here, take a soul badge. High five. Soul badge from Koga. Now that you have a soul badge, Pokemon up to level 60 will heed your command if you receive them in a trade. Ah, take this too. Toxic. Toxic. Such a good move. Put it in a case. Sealed within that TM27 lies the move Toxic. It's an ancient move passed down through my family for 400 years. When hit with toxic poisonous effects, Pokemon will take more and more damage for each turn that passes in battle. It will surely terrorize your opponent, unless they KO you in one turn and then switch out. Yeah. Alright, let's see what Eevee has to say. More and more fired up from the high five. Alright, time for me to step out the door and for Michael to take over. <laughs> it is my turn. Alright, it's time to skip cutscene. 
mostly. Aaron switched to me too fast. I was just finishing up with my, uh, switching my party around. Oh, sorry. I hope you left enough Pokemon in your team to deal with his Protect, Spam, and Toxic. I think I'll be fine. That Protect, Spam, though. All Let's right. hope I didn't fluff up my starter. Pikachu my, versus my Team Koga. Also, you better watch out. This thing likes to go boom. Don't, don't I know it. Alakazam! Alakazam. Fight. Uh, oh, right. Psychic. Kazam, I know you can do it. <laughs> I knew you could do it. I forgot you have an Alakazam. He's going to body him. I'm going to steamroll a Koga. <laughs> Koga's going to get bodied. <laughs> Nitter ring. Mm. Uh, Venomoth. Ah, nah, I think I'll stay. Alright, let's see if uh, I can do this, guys. I don't know. Alakazam was a beast in Gen 1, and even now in Gen, like, 8, eight? or 7, it's, like still a, seven. It's, it's still a beast. Oh no, he protected himself. Oh, what will I do? Uh, I don't know. Psychic! Use more psychic. Be even more psychically powered. Dead. Bend that spoon harder. <clears throat> Dead. <laughs> hey, Michael. There are no spoons. There is one spoon. There are two spoons. Who are you, Mumbo Jumbo? <laughs> there are way too many spoons. Oh, I'm learning a move. Uh, Scratch. Goodbye, Scratch. Hello, Toxic. Wow, she learns it naturally. Yep, yeah, Robert. Uh, sh I don't... Should I hit a Raijin for Gold Bat? Nah. Let's just kill it. Robert, Still, let's I stick with this guy. You. That the Pokemon named after you has toxic they didn't learn that. Psychic! What he needs is Sludge Bomb. I predict your death. Or I'm Psychic, death. guys. I predicted mm. his death. I have seen your death. It was painful. Alright, alright. He's got one left. I don't know if I can do this, guys. He's, he's been pounding me pretty hard so far. It's Muck! Oh, oh god. Damn. I am so screwed, guys. Yes, you are. I am so screwed. Psychic! Psychic! You are a little over level. Protect! Today. No! You he didn't protected one himself. shot him. How could he? You failed to one shot. Okay, you okay. Failed. I've run out of PP, guys. Run out of PP. Bye. I need to drink some soda. Oh! He lived! And. Ooh. Sludge Bomb! Oh, he got an attack on me! Ow! Oh, poison! God, what am I gonna do, guys? I don't know. It's not like I have a whole party full of Pokemon and he's got one left or anything now. That's not a thing. Protect! Oh, no he didn't. That um, would have been the smart move. Whew! I just barely scraped by that, guys. Barely. Man, if I lost if I lost him, it was over. If I lost him, it would be over. Your work turtle yep. should be evolving, yeah. Over. Mm-hmm. Nidoran. Sandshrew. Mm-hmm. Yep, yeah, yeah. over. Blah 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 blah. So, uh, when I said it was over, <laughs> War Turtle is evolving. Well, it's time for uh, it's time to fire main cannons. Last choice has to be my favorite looking starter from this generation. Last wars. Oh, for the OG. My first Cannon one to get him now. Hmm. My first one to get him. I don't remember. Yes, I don't have mine. Aha! Take that! Once it takes aim at its enemy, it blasts out water with even more force than a fire hose. Well, yeah, the fire hose is War Turtle. Wait, what's this? A second one! Another one! And another one. And I'm gonna have to Moonstone this immediately after. <laughs> I'm not sure if we I have I think I evolved anything. mine on camera, though. Yeah, I have one. You do? Okay, then we don't need to. Every time we evolve, we switch. Uh, Nidorina! We've already read the data, so I'm just gonna skip through it. Yeah, the only uh, we've already was some prefix relaxed. All but right. There's more where that came oh, from. Wait, what, you dude? We've already seen this, and if but you... not an Alolan Geo, dude. Yeah, we didn't see the Alolan Geo, the Geo evolution. Oh, and the Alolan Gra uh, Golem. That is such a good-looking Pokemon. Jogger. I mean, Graveler. Graveler. 
Does its dex data different for Alolan form? Yes. Yes. Sweet. But you have to actually oh, go do damn. the Pokedex to see it. What? Sandshrew? Regular. Just how many guys did I evolve in that battle? All of them. Every last one. You know, I have to say, I, I prefer the Alolan Sandshrew instead of Slash over regular. I steal is such a good type. Unless you're punching it. Or setting it on fire. Pretty much. It is skill that's slashing enemies with its claws. If broken, they start to grow back in a day. Whew, I think we're done now. Oh, wait, I am done. What? Here, take a soul badge. Yes, take this badge, son. Hmm. Must not have granted experience high enough. Now that you have the soul badge, Pokemon up to level 60 will heed your command if you receive them in a trade. Ah, oh, take this too. We got Toxic again! Still within that team lies the move Toxic. It is an ancient move, passed down through my family for 400 years. This move had been passed down through the Armstrong generation for... Or family for generations. Aaron already read all this, so I'm yeah. skipping through it. Alright, so uh, I actually wasn't kidding. If I lost a, a Kazam, I'd have been screwed. Well, I mean, Blast is my very boy. Rhyhorn might have been able to handle ah, it. Ah, there we go. Rhyhorn was the one that didn't evolve. I think it's 42. Rhyhorn, why didn't you evolve? How close is he? If he's one experience point, I'm going to laugh. Nah, a good thousand. He's pretty, pretty good far away. Okay, I guess I fluffed that up. I was supposed to get five evolutions at the end of that battle. Well, anyway, I need a Moonstone, my Nidorino, or Nidorina, whichever one and it is. And see that dialogue before you leave the building? And I need to go find a Firestone from a department store. So we're switching to Aaron for now. Who's going Actually, to a we shop? we should probably just go ahead and call it a video and do all this stuff off camera. Un momento. I want to show you guys something I figured out the other day. I'm gonna buy... 70 Ultra Balls at once. Okay. Wow, has it already been a full episode almost? You also get amazing. 7 Premier Balls as a bonus. Yeah, yeah, it's stacks, guys. I already knew that. Why didn't you say anything? What stacks? The Premier Balls you get. But you don't have to buy really them in stacks great, of 10 so... now. So you can buy more than... Okay. Yes. Every game before this, you had to buy them in stacks of 10 yes. or you only get one. I mean, if you bought 20, you'd only get one instead of two. So I've been buying them in stacks of 10 this whole time. Uh, I'm gonna buy me some... Don't buy Great Balls. I'm buying everything, Robert. Why would you waste your money on Great Balls when you could have Ultra Balls, which are better? Because I have 157 Ultra Balls? But you could have 200. I could, but I'll come back to do that. Okay. I believe it's time to head east out of town. You know what I would have said if you had 200 Ultra Balls? You could have 300. What would I have said if you had 300 Ultra Balls? You could have 900. Oh crap, I'm with the wrong floor again. You made a jump there. I was skipping the rest in the middle because you knew what I was going to say. Okay. Also, there's no Safari Zone. That sucks! Yeah, except this whole game kind of is the Safari Zone. Yeah. Alright. Uh... Okay. Okay, I think that's the wrong floor. Darn it! Can okay. I ever find the floor that has the stones? Cubone is 600 away. Then I we'll... think we should end off here. At the beginning of Route 15. I'm here to buy. So as I said, the door. Or right here. Yeah, right about here seems good. Oh crap, I said no. <laughs> Michael's just uh, buying, stones. buying stones. And he can do that in between episodes. And we're already a minute over time. Really? Robert, go. how many times do we have to go over this? That's not over time. We have a minute of episode left. Seriously, viewers, it is... Getting irritating how much yeah. we have to tell him this. You've had to hear it, too. It has been a month and a half since we recorded this last. It hasn't changed. Nothing has ever changed! What are you talking are about? Are you the kid who's working on a Pokedex? What if Professor Oak's assistants came by here, and he seemed to be looking for you? Why am I yelling? Go upstairs! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, you. Is this a new area? Hi, remember me? No! I'm one of Professor Oak's aides, assistants. The professor told me that if your Pokedex has good data on 50 species of Pokemon, I'm to give you this wonderful item. What is it? So, Alana, let's smell like a firm. So, Alana, let me ask you. Have you gathered, have you gathered data, data on at least, least 50, 50 species? species of Pokemon? Yes. Yes. Great! You have got 78 species of Pokemon. That's still a long way to go. Congratulations. Here, take this wonderful item. Oh, I don't have it. Did I lose it? 
Oh, sorry, what shall I do? I don't have anything I can give you. What? Except, I know. Take the clothes off my back. What the flip? <laughs> Whew. Okay, here it is. Now you can look like an assistant from Professor Oak. You put the assistant set in your clothing trunk. I made adjustments on my lab coat for you and your po- Right here? You must be one hell of a seamstress. My precious lab coat, please wear it with care. What? What do you call a male seamstress? A tailor? I think so. Almost there. There, I'm back to the safari set. Oh, you're set. putting it on her. Never mind. Putting it on both of them. Hold on. Oh, did I just change the safari set only to get clothes to change into? Yeah. Oh, wow. Um, I feel dumb. It looks like it's an all-white set. It looks kind of like a lab coat. Let me get through the dialogue real quick to get the clothes so you can see it on this dude. And that will be a good way to end the episode. episode. Properly. Um, whoosh. I'm going to turn around and show the bag off. I will. Assistant set. Huh. Okay. I like it. It's a brown bag. Oh, that's, right. That's I'm very brown. There. I'm going down the stairs. We will show Michael. Well, don't stop. Don't keep stopping. Just freaking walk down the stairs, man. I meant for you guys to use that. Oh, here, assistant. There we go. Well, that... that we. No, you gotta keep walking, man. You can't just stop, man. I'm stopping right here for next episode. Assistant T. I mean, when you're saying you're gonna transition, and then you stop, and then you walk two feet, and then you stop, how about you just keep you going? Know, oh, that's what you that mean. That hat and coat combo reminds me of old people in Florida on who have retired. Ha. Huh. Specifically the one on Pikachu, I mean. I see what you mean. I'm so white. It's too white in here. Is it white in here, or is it just you? It's all three of us. Don't forget to check your bag. I want to see what color the Pokeball changes to. You didn't get this one? Oh, it's still very brown. Okay, that's kind of crappy looking. I'll keep it on for the next episode. My favorite but bag is the Team Rocket bag. I will have to agree. How about Ryzen? I look like I'm on vac- Ryzen looks like he's a, an old lady on vacation or something. Well, that's what I just said. He reminds me of old people in Florida. And let's be fair, Jamie looks like... One of those young people trying to be hit. And Anyway, we actually are going over time now. Yeah. So, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, we will see you in the next episode. Pikachu out. Eevee out. And Robert saying goodbye. And Jamie looks intrigued in your hat. Bye, everybody. <laughs>